Um, I just want to say, yes, the chairman did, right, actually, right in the very beginning, you did explain that. That's how right. The town did almost match, well, maybe even more, invest in order for the state to do that work. But I just wanted to tell everyone one thing. I 100% agree with what Selectman Bean and what Selectman Griffin had just said. That meeting was stacked. It was stacked against the town. It was stacked against the citizens of this town, and it was stacked against the Board of Selectmen. I went to it because I was under the impression that it was going to be about, you know, ways we can work together to invest in the state, invest in Hampton Beach. I thought it was very positive that the governor was going to be there. And immediately, when certain people began talking, I knew what the meeting was, what the agenda of the meeting was. Whether or not there was a written agenda or not, I'm not sure of. But I it made me not. very uncomfortable as a selectman, and I purposely spoke on an issue that didn't have anything to do with the suit because that's not, a public forum is not the setting that you discuss a uh, pending litigation suit in. And I also wanted to add with something that Selectman uh, Bean said that I was the Selectman that was approached by the former senator and uh, was requested that I note that I do not renew Fred's contract which I understand everyone has their right to give input. I'm a selectman. I'm an elected official. I was elected by this town the same way that the five of us sitting here were, and I was elected by the people, and the only reason I did this job was for the town of Hampton. And I want to make that very clear. The only reason I am doing this job is for the town of Hampton and for every single person in business that live here. And I'm new, and I'm learning. I don't have the 14 or 15 years' experience but when I walked into that room and those people started talking, I'll tell you right now, something is up and something stinks. And I am 100% behind this lawsuit and I am not backing down from it and I want everyone to know that. You do not pull someone aside and have them meet you in a s different town and tell them after you know that they've only been a public elected official for 18 months, tell them to fire their town manager. You don't do that. It's wrong. That's all I have to say.